Constructing your life is about much more than just building a bank account. Each week, join real estate entrepreneur and mindset coach Austin Linney as he interviews guests who are constructing their dream lives and impacting the world around them on a daily basis. If you're an entrepreneur or wanting to start a business or you just want to hear motivating stories of how others have overcome the odds, you are in the right place. And now for your host, Austin Linney. Guys, welcome back to the Construct Your Life rant. This is Austin Linney here uh, coming to you with your rant today. You know, what we're going to talk about today is art. You know, we're going to talk about what it looks like to share your art with the world. You know, a lot of people that are in investing or personal development or so on and so on have this connotation with art as it needs to be something. It needs to look like something like a painting or something like that. And and, and in case that is art, but the art of who you are, the art of constructing your life for you is so much bigger than that. And it's not um, like I'm trying to get all metaphysical or anything, but basically you have these intangible gifts with inside of you. You have these Um, unspeakable things that for you, it's so much easier than other people, right? Whether you can raise money than everybody, like that better than everybody, that's your art. Whether or not you can um, create a spreadsheet better than anybody, that's your art. And when you lean into your art, to your gift, then you can truly be the best version of yourself. And so when I go networking or I'm setting up events, like that's something that's very easy to me. I'm very calm in that moment to set up these events. And everybody goes, oh, my God, if I would have to do that, I mean, I don't know what I would do. It it seems like such a small, a big task. And yet it is for me and it's exhausting, but I love it. And so when I love it, it's very easy for me. So I'm asking you to look at your life and understand what art are you creating? Like, are you creating, there's an art to being a a multifamily operator because you're a landlord and you're creating this space for somebody that they can make memories with and so many things. And I think so many times we lose the human aspect of what we're doing, whether that be Airbnb or flipping or all these things. And your art is that you're a flipper, right? But what you don't understand is that you're giving the people that work for you from your art and your design and all your things, you're giving them a way for them to make money to feed their family. And so what this whole conversation that I'm trying to have right now is just a conversation around understanding that real estate investing and all these things are bigger than yourself. And when you can look at it from an art point of view, from a kind of a, an amazing, um, just to, you know, when we start out, it's so exciting for real estate. And I think sometimes the lull or the monotony of the plateau can get very boring. I think we read books, we're, we're, you know, we're always consuming content. And what I ask my coaching clients to do is like, maybe read a book on like Latin dancing, right? Maybe read a book on like painting or like from a philosopher. And what you're doing is you're just understanding there's aspects about what you do that it comes easy to you and it's different and it's fun. And sometimes the monotony of doing the deals over and over again can become sort of what of kind of like, it just, you don't get any more thrill or joy from it. And so what I've done in the past, and I'm just trying to talk about from my example is I'll go put down the personal developments, the real estate books, and I'll read a book about art and you understand how much you can relate to these artists who are trying to create this vision. That's why I think I'm drawn to being a developer or a builder because I understand the concepts of art. And when you understand that who you are and what you do moves through you and it's part of your gift and it's part of um, what you can offer up to the world, you understand that this this game that we're doing, this real estate space, this, this, this getting healthy, this all these things is part of who you are. And when it's part of who you are and you can understand the concepts um, that you're creating something special, it allows you to speak through your art. And, you know, I know I'm you're like, what is this dude talking about? Right. But like what I'm saying is like when you can make 
it about your art and what you're best at, that it's bigger than you. And, and you can understand that you're providing a housing for families or you're providing jobs for your employees. It creates this amazing, um, just kind of like fulfillment triangle. And it allows you to really tap into what you're doing. And it doesn't become so much about the day to day. It becomes about a bigger part of what you're offering up to the world. And so if you're amazing at spreadsheets, then partner up with a guy who has a relationships. If you're amazing at networking then partner up with a guy who's great at spreadsheets and through that amazing connection, and you can create this art of just this business that is churning out uh, deals for you. And it's a part of who you are. And the book I would suggest is Rocket Fuel. Um, it's an amazing book about taking an integrator and a visionary and just creating this amazing synergy of, the, of what they bring to the table to create this unstoppable force. So I know, I hope everybody got some value from this. You know, it's, it's an amazing opportunity for you to look at everything you're doing in a different light. So I hope everybody has a great day. We'll talk to you soon. Thank you for listening to Construct Your Life with Austin Lenny. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to rate, review, subscribe, and pay it forward by sharing with a friend. Most importantly, take this opportunity to start constructing your life by taking immediate action on what you learned. For show notes, resources, and more information on one-on-one coaching with Austin, visit constructyourlifepodcast.com.